You must have thought about it. Clipping him yourself? You mean when he took my wife? Or burned my face? No. Never thought about that. Not once. But you didn't because you chose to survive instead of focusing on past discomforts. You were an adult. You did what you had to, to live. And yet our leader is not doing the same. If it was my call, we'd say enough. We'd branch out, we'd find new places, we'd make new relationships. We'd make sure the saviors survive as you chose to. And we'd move on from past discomforts as you wisely chose to. <laughs> well, here I am. My nuts blowing in the breeze, naked as a jaybird. What do you say? Just move on? Just move on. Could be his. You know the bucket he brought with him? It could be anywhere. Alive or dead. Somewhere in between. Just because he walked away doesn't mean he's breathing. We can keep looking. Maybe find him more alive than dead, but then what? We could face a distasteful moment. Or we could walk away. Get back to our people and make things even better. This is a critical point in our history, Dwight. This is something we could tell our grandkids about. Thank you. 